Compassion for me is a call to action. Uh, we see a lot of people in suffering or, or in spiritual needs or in physical needs. We need to see these people in the same way which Jesus saw. Meeting a need um, that you see in someone else's life, whether or not they have any right to that. Being there for them in their good times, in their bad times. I'm not a great theologian, I'm not a great preacher, but I'm a doer. I'm a practical bloke, so that's what I do. Uh, the word compassion to me uh, would probably mean walking alongside somebody, helping where uh, you can, um, doing something, expecting nothing in return. It uh, is not something you, um, that comes naturally, but when you have the Holy Spirit in you, uh, you have all those uh, fruit of the, uh, that's fruit of the Spirit. Just picture in my head Jesus looking out uh, at the people who were sort of following him around, wanting to listen uh, to what he had to say, and having him having compassion on them, him having that love for them, um, because they were like sheep without a shepherd. بدون هیچ چشم داشتی همسایه خود تو مثل خودت دوست داشت باش. That's that's our mission as a church to be to be drawing alongside those who are suffering and. Um, showing them God's love, God's care, uh, both practically and through sharing uh, the gospel. Compassion means to me considering being in someone else's shoes. Nobody has really much control over what happens to them or around them or where they find themselves. Anyone could find themselves displaced or having to start somewhere new. Compassion is not just empathy for people. Well, as a Christian, we don't believe it's just helping people for helping. But in the same way, God have mercy and loved us. In the same way, we need to show uh, for the other people this kind of mercy and this kind of love. <laughs>